Miami at four and one. Still in the top 25 at number 25. North Carolina five and oh for the first time since 1997 and ranked number 12. Asor has been very versatile for this Tar Heel offense. Third down and 10. May. This is what he can do. Did he slide down too early would be the question. They played the Penn Quakers in 1939. <laughs> Tyler Van Dyke given all kinds of time. Runs out of time. Goes down. Got back to about the line of scrimmage. Kevin Hester Jr. 115 pounds of junior from Fort Lauderdale. Carolina going very quickly. They'll mix up the tempos. Wide open down. Into Miami territory and banged out. And they continue at a high tempo. Chip Lindsay is the first year offensive coordinator. May, lots of running room. And he can move. And out of bounds at the 26. Too much chaos, you're too aggressive. There's running lanes for the quarterback, and May's going to take advantage. Omarion Hampton into the secondary. And he delivered some punishment. In a one-on-one, -on -one, that's where May's going to go. Third down and goal. Six and a half in the quarter. And a touchdown! Tez Walker! His first touchdown catch as a Tar Heel! First down. Parrish again. Ball's out. Had he crossed the goal line? For the moment, it's North Carolina ball. How about this Tar Heel defense? That's Bo Atkinson. Uh, backup defensive end. Four receivers spread the field. Quick pop. Walker. First down to the 23-yard line. One out of three now. Van Dyke is six out of nine passing for 89 and a touchdown. Setting up a screen. Parrish swung down by the tackling machine. Cedric Gray drops it for a loss. Did she ace it? Probably so. So now Carolina trailing for the first time tonight. Omarion Hampton driving the pile with plenty of push from his offensive linemen and tight ends. North Carolina on the move. After the 14-yard run. They fake the handoff up the middle. It's a reverse. Tez Walker steps out of bounds near the 30. And seven runs. And it has been working. They're powering their way down the field. And they power the end zone for a touchdown. Omarion Hampton. Nice touchdown drive. But finished the half three for his last nine. It is one for one in this half. Launching it again for Walker. He has it. Touchdown. He got behind Jaden Davis without being held that time. 56 yards, second score of the night for Walker. Not having an impact on the quarterback's accuracy so far, that's for sure. It's just a light rain now in uh, trouble with the ball. Tar Heels think they have it, and they do. Miles Murphy came away with it. It was one of those pictures at the end of the game last week. So emotional after that excruciating loss. And here's Omarion Hampton. After the defense got the ball back, here's Van Dyke with nine minutes to go in the third quarter. He throws an interception. Under throw his receiver right to Cedric Gray. Cedric Gray watching Van Dyke the entire way, just slowly drifting out into his zone drop area. Underneath the curl route that Van Dyke's trying to hit. Career long is 48. And this would be about 50 from here. Nay, protected well this time. And it's Walker again. Taz Walker. Third touchdown of the night. And a flag after the play. Now, they're a significantly better team. With him at wide receiver. Parrish now dumped for a one-yard loss by Miles Murphy. One out of five on third down tonight. 
Three-man rush. They still get there. Came and Wrecker took him down for the first Carolina sack of the night. Play, it was the interception, three plays and a punt. May has a wide open receiver in the flat. John Copenhaver escapes the tackle and finally tackled around the legs by Cam Kitchens. Second and two at the 14. Hampton dragging tacklers with him to Corey Couch in a field goal. Touchdown makes it a three score game. Under three minutes to go. May beautiful play design great call well executed there is a flag words we have said before tonight if it stands it's a receiving touchdown for Hampton Wow and still an 18 point lead and Van Dyke goes down for a big North Carolina takes over at its own 44. The design run for May. First down and 11 yard run. Up. Second and six, North Carolina on the move again. They're at the Miami 40. Omarion Hampton. Shoved out of bounds by James Williams. British Brooks, the running back. Quick screen, Nate McCollum. And it's not just Tez Walker, McCollum. Burnett is seven out of seven in field goals this year. He's eight out of eight. Looking for Restrepo. And he can't hang on. It's broken up by Huzzy. Rushed for 177 yards, and that total is growing with every step. Hampton trying to go all the way. He got dragged down by to Corey Couch. Connected from 34, and he's eight for eight this year. After he lost his starting kicking job to the transfer Ryan Cole. That one almost blocked. Will Rocha is the other kicker. He did the fake and then Bora Gallus kicked it. And it's handled by Tez Walker. He has something to say to the Miami sideline after the recovery. Followed closely by Duke, but that's very dependent on Riley Leonard's health. First and five, he goes down again. For the third time, it's Cayman Rucker. Last play, barring a penalty, Van Dyke down the seam and intercepted. Geo Biggers ends it 